football kicker the Frankly. Hey, Freddie. Hey, Fitz. Um, what coaches do you think face the most pressure in both college and the NFL? I'm going to say Dino Barbers for Syracuse and Kitchens for uh, the NFL. What, what, what coaches do you think face the most pressure? Um, for my money in college, it's easy to say it's Nick Saban, but I think right Twitter, Coleman ESPN, and at EM Fitz ESPN, but you can wait to do that some other time. Right now, it's time for you to get your 15 seconds of fame on by being part of the frenzy at triple eight say ESPN eight 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 seven two nine three seven seven six. Whatever's on your mind in the world of sports, make sure you are heard loud and proud in 15 seconds or less. Ryan Matlack will handle the tracks. You bring the funk and the facts together. It's going to be a good frenzy. Thank you very much, Jonathan. The great city of Buffalo, kick off the frenzy. Hey, Fitz. Um. What coaches do you think face the most pressure in both college and NFL? Let's say Dino Barber's the Syracuse and Fitz for the NFL. What, what, what coaches do you think face the most pressure? Um, for my money in college, it's easy to say it's Nick Saban, but I think right now the guy facing the most pressure is Clay Helton of USC because his job security is the one that's under siege. And I'll say in the NFL right now is Freddie Kitchens of Cleveland because of all the hype. And all the passes, the hype patrol were able to accumulate in the offseason with the Cleveland Browns being that it team. I'm amazed that you were able to, to make that out from that phone call. You're welcome. Where I couldn't understand half of it. You're welcome. Uh, but if he's asking what college coach has the most pressure, mm -hmm. week one, uh, I'm, I'm, to me, it's a no-brainer. It's Gus Malzahn. Uh, and, he, and I talked to him about it at SEC Media Days. He told me, look, that that's, that's the job. Here at, at Auburn... If we're not contending for national championships, then you're going to be on a hot seat. And he just signed a big, big deal. Yes, he did. You know, what, a year ago. So if there's a coach that is, and I hate the hot seat thing. I can't stand it. It drives me insane. Right. But if you're talking about pressure coming in on a coach to have a successful season coming into week one, I think it's the game we'll have on ESPN Radio with Sean Kelly, Barrett Jones, and my sorry butt on the call. And that's the Auburn Tigers and Gus Malzahn. William in Tennessee, what you got? Uh, what got me in the football? 